Hi, and welcome to my channel. So you're an awesome teacher, and you have created a Bitmoji virtual classroom. You have already prepared all of your students' activities, assignments, and labs for the entire school year. And you have also created hyperlinks in your Google Slides. However, you don't want your students to have access to these assignments and other hyperlinks in your Google Slides classroom. In this video tutorial, I will teach you how to restrict your students from accessing future assignments in your Google Slides virtual classroom. You will also learn how to prevent viewers from downloading your Google Slides. But before we begin, and if you are new here, please click the like and subscribe button and leave me your comments below. Restricting your students from accessing an assignment or a hyperlink in your Google Slide is easy as one, two, three. So let's go ahead and learn how to do that. Let us say that there are assignments and hyperlinks in an ecosystem unit that we don't want our students to access. So how do we limit the access? First, we will have to insert a shape in our slide. So let's go ahead and click on Insert, Shape, and select the shape that we want to use. Then the next thing we will do is to make the shape transparent. To do that, you will have to click Fill Color, Custom, and change the transparency of the shape. Hit OK. Also, we will have to remove the border of our box. Hit Transparent. Now our transparent box is ready for use. So let's say we don't want our students to access section 1.7 up to section 1.11 of the ecosystem unit. So what I'm going to do is drag this transparent box in front of those sections. Now these sections are restricted. Now let's check if it's going to work. As you can see, when I hover my mouse in the ecosystem menu, the hand icon is showing for those sections that your students can access. So that's going to be section 1.2, 1.3, 1.4, up to 1.6. But if you go down to 1.7, the hand icon disappear. That means that these sections are restricted. Now there's only one thing left that we have to do, and that is to prevent viewers and our students from downloading our Google Slide. So how do we prevent our students and viewers from downloading our Google Slide? In order for us to do that, we will have to go to the folder where we saved our virtual classroom. So this is the folder where I saved my virtual classroom. To limit the access and download of my virtual classroom Google Slide, we will have to click on our virtual classroom On the upper right corner of your screen, you will see this share icon. Click this. Click the gear icon on the upper right corner and make sure that this option is unchecked. Now let's see if I will not be able to download my Google Slides. I will go ahead and get a shareable link. Then I will go to my other Google Drive account. I am now viewing my virtual classroom in my other Google Drive. When I click on File, you will see that the download option is that just means that I will not be able to download this Google Slide virtual classroom. I think that's it for now. I will see you next time.